you are a great speaker and i really i astonished a lot when i heard about you have been working only for one and a half month and the second one you started your communication just on video call so it's yeah. really amazing for me i really i'm so glad uh, that you have a great uh, confidence and ma'am good afternoon how are you yes sir uh, very good afternoon i am very fine sir sir thank you for asking what about you sir i yeah, am also to great thank you so much for asking as well yeah okay so uh, we are meeting here first time so we can go for the introduction part am i right yeah okay so i would be happy to listen your introduction could you please introduce little bit yes uh, as you know my name is saraswati i live in mumbai basically i belong to up and if you ask okay. about my education i am ba bs and uh, along with that i also completed my web designing course and worked for 15 years in mumbai and uh, that is one software okay. uh, named photoshop yeah nowadays i am a homemaker and simultaneously i am also running my youtube channel yeah that's all about me oh that's wonderful i'm really glad to hear you that you are working professional and at the same time you are doing multiple work that's very wonderful okay so this is my turn i'm going to introduce little myself then after we can go for the further further conversation yeah. so my name is ali i belong to uttar pradesh as well when it comes to my profession i'm working as a accountant if i talk about my education so i am a graduate person i did pg dc with my computer apart from this when i get free time so i uh, work on youtube also and in free time i talk different learners youtubers yeah, this is all about me okay that's great yeah. so just i want to ask few question that we can go for another session so okay. yeah my first question is how long have you been working on your communication skill uh, only one and half month before oh my god it's very yeah. amazing only you started your communication is given in a half month ago and right now you are able to talk different people even i have seen like your channel before few uh, weeks ago maybe one or two weeks ago and that time i found you you were talking to someone else but what i observed lot of people when they started learning english language they are not going to speak very clearly and very confidently one and two months sometimes they are going to face uh some hesitation they are going to think about the grammar section they are going to feel different problem and you are yeah. facing the camera oh my god it's very wonderful that i'm getting really it's very positive energy i'm getting from your side yeah. so really i'm glad so why did you think to come on this platform and what made you to enhance your english language actually i started my journey last year and on 15th of august uh, it has completed one year and when i started my channel i just uh, upload videos of miss my daughter's video and after that i thought that i also upload some grammar portion because when i completed my graduation and my ba degree my subject was english and uh, english was my favorite subject at that time okay. so i just started to upload grammar portion yeah and later i realized that i also upload you know i should also work on my communication skill because uh, at that time i also want to speak this language but uh, at that time there was not such an environment to whom i can uh, communicate nowadays yeah, yeah. i have a chance i have a time also so i just started and working on my communication skill yeah okay that's great okay that's great so that mean your uh, already subject was in english language in your graduation okay yeah. so you have done like b ed as well yeah okay that's great so when did you complete uh, b ed like these days these years or before uh, mm. many years actually i completed my uh, graduation in 1999 oh and god <laughs> uh completed my ba degree in 2002 from mumbai university okay yeah okay that's that's great 2002 okay yeah. it's even it's long distance <laughs> yeah very and after distance. in the in that period i have not touched with grammar 
means english for me with english language i just started uh, to means uh, touch with english subject only when my daughter uh, came in you know from kg level i uh -huh. teach my daughter and now she is in fifth standard yeah okay, that's why okay. i am able to speak little bit english in front of anyone uh -huh. that is one reason uh -huh. and you can say this is one benefit of me yeah of course you are getting benefits and that's the things i'm looking that's yeah. right okay so <coughs> sorry so before starting like one and uh, half month ago when you started english language at this situation uh, what was your level what did you think at this situation uh, am i speak or not like this so what was your level did you think about the grammar section or anything else uh, actually sir i i can't judge myself yes my first video upload on my youtube channel that was my first communication okay yeah so you didn't start your communication with audio call no oh my god it's so much amazing okay yeah. that means you already have a lot of confidence lot of girls to do something yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. that's yeah. wonderful that's wonderful so what your uh, when you were in college life so at yeah. that situation what was what was your confidence and what was your role in class and everything yes i was very bright student in my school time and in my college time also i was gold medalist of my college oh my god this wonderful yeah. and glad really i'm so glad yeah. okay that mean you were so much studious and now that's the reason you have a lot of guts and confidence yeah. that you can talk to anyone. even after completing my graduation from uh, hindi medium school and from up when i came to mumbai at same year i got admission in ba okay and uh, every people were you know speaking in english uh, and uh, you know i just came from village and take uh, to admission in ba college and my college was in a very good place like juhu okay yeah so okay. i at that time i faced a lot of difficulties in speaking difficulties other problems also but yes at that time i got b grade in my ba but okay. i thought that that is you know uh, similar to a plus grade for me oh that's yeah. that's great wonderful and how was your experience you uh, you were telling about you are working on photoshop i think it out photoshop yeah so what kinds of things are you doing actually i worked on you know for old photos like uh, retouching and restoration job and uh, along with that i also designed wedding album uh -huh. yeah okay okay that's good so you have been working uh, in this field like 15 years yeah oh you have a great <laughs> experience yes. over it and along with that okay. i am also learned means uh, photography also and uh, sometimes i also went outside to click photos oh that's yeah. good you love to work with photos <laughs> that's yeah. that's great okay so what's your opinion over this language what what uh, what fluency do you want to achieve actually what i want to be a fluent speaker means uh, i at least i want to communicate at any topic with any person if i will get that's that after that i will think after what should i do further okay okay that yeah. mean uh, still you don't have any desire to, to be as a teacher english trainer or a good youtuber because you are doing on youtube so maybe you have a good desire for it or anything special uh, had you kept uh, keep uh, kept in mind in your mind to do something like actually if i will be you know able to explain everything and uh, you know when i will uh, means uh, teach people so nicely so definitely people will connect with me sure. it will take time all of sudden yeah, yeah, nothing yeah. happen but yes i will try my best to achieve that on the to top, to reach the top level 
Okay, that's wonderful. Yeah. Sure, I wish you are going to take your position or you are going to get your level, whatever you want. And uh, you have a good confidence. You don't have a hesitation. And sure, you are going to make others very well understand. That will help you to enhance your confidence and others also. That's that's good. Yeah. And the same thing I uh, means uh, say to other people. Only if you have a confidence, whatever you have vocabs, whatever knowledge you have about English, you just start to speak. Uh -huh. Definitely. Uh, after some times, so fluency will come. Absolutely, all right. This is yeah. the magic, I think. When you are going to do anything, not only English language, you are going to achieve any yeah. goal, or you are going to do any work. Slowly, slowly, if you are going to do, sure, you are going to get your uh, level and your achievement. Yeah. And one more thing, uh, always, you know, we we should always ready to face fear. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And one time it that as well as difficulties. It, yes. First, when you face once you face fear, definitely everything will come, you know, very good. Uh, everything will happen yeah. very nicely. Absolutely, all right. And in every field, if we are going to take any skill, if you are going to do any, uh, get any desired work, so sure we are going to face some difficulties because as much as the goal is longer and big as much as we are going to face some difficulties. Yeah. So difficulty and one that you know is that a part one of... Is there, where there is will, there is way. So definitely, if you have great will, definitely you will find your way. Absolutely, all right. This, this, yeah. this is the truth. This is the fact. Okay. So that means now you are able to talk randomly and you are thinking to go for uh, topic conversation and some special conversation. So what do you think about the topic conversation and what would you feel when you go for the topic conversation? That means you feel you should be more uh, uh, extendable knowledge or you should only for the vocabulary. What's your opinion over it to talk on topic? Suppose, it's good. Suppose when we go on one particular topic to discuss, that is very good because uh, uh, suppose sometimes we are not familiar with that topic and we have yeah. not much knowledge about that topic to, uh, to do conversation. So definitely one day before we decide what is, uh, what is our topic. So yeah. at that time, you know, we will uh, uh, prepare for that topic. Mm -hmm. And when we prepare uh, some topic, so definitely uh, we find some, some new words, some new vocab. Mm. And in this way, we can enhance our vocabs. Right. Yeah. This is also my belief because whenever I talk to any people to any special topic, that time, if I am I, I am not able to speak little and the front of person also not able to speak over it. So what happened? That is the reason of two things only. We don't have a proper knowledge about that thing, and we don't have a proper vocabulary about this. If yeah. we have a proper knowledge, so we can explore the things. But sometimes yeah. what happened, we random choose the topic, any impromptu select the topic and we didn't prepare little. Mm -hmm. So at that situation, what happened? Automatically mind goes blank. Mind yeah. thinks, what should I speak? What should I not speak? How can I add some sentences and values? So mind automatically, you know, run after the words and sentences and vocabulary. So yeah. This is the problem when we are going to talk any specific topic. So before going to topic, we should try to prepare a little because yeah. already if we don't have the awareness of that topic, we don't have proper word, proper vocabulary, so what we will speak. So for yeah. it, it's very important to once and two times Google it and go for social media and utilize the techniques, how we can learn, how we can use it. And then after we can go for the talk. And when we talk this kind of activities, sure, we are going to create some confidence. We are going to boost our confidence. So preparation also very important to boost the confidence yeah. because when we are going to talk someone and at this situation, we are not able to talk. We are not able to speak. So automatically the confidence level is going down. Yeah. But if we are going to speak little in front of anyone, our confidence is going to up. So yeah. it's very important to little prepare anything before go to stage and before go to any conversation. Yes, because you know, we are learners. Mm. And uh, we, if we have, you know, experienced person, that is different thing. And uh, means, uh, 
we just uh, decide and uh, decide the topic and do conversation but we are learners so definitely we should uh, prepare on that particular topic and after that when do when we do conversation so at that time our, our conversation will be good absolutely all right that mean i am going to give you one example if you are going to talk about the social media so on the social media people can speak little because already know that the social media side the use of the social media the benefits and uh, disadvantage of the social media the people can speak but same time if we are going to talk about the politics and we don't have a good desire and we don't have a good connection with politics so maybe yeah. we are not going to speak so mm. this is the important thing that mean if we have awareness at this situation we can speak but if we don't have awareness so how can we speak yeah definitely and it also depend depend on person to person what is your level correct oh, because no, no. as i am learning this language and speaking this language only one and half month so definitely oh. yes i am able to speak on any topic but uh, if uh, i prepare one day before so at that time i will uh, means uh, speak and communicate well absolutely right like, that mean you wanna to say yeah go ahead yes means uh, at that time i convey my thoughts in a very professional way right absolutely all right i got from uh, i got a point what were you want to say that mean i have also like this thought if someone going to talk on any any special topic so one more thing is it is important if you are a beginner and you are belong to intermediate level so don't think more about the topic just you run after step by step if you are a beginner so just you try to complete your model complete your tenses passive whatever it need for the beginning time and just you try to make a random conversation in a beginning stage if you are going to interact any fluent people and you want to talk on any topic so that mean you are going to mess your conversation you are going to down your confidence level so this is very important what's your level and try to talk most of time the level you achieve the level you are going to talk same level you are going to interact more and more time the same level you are going to choose topic and conversational thing because in a beginning stage we can go for the random conversation we can ask about the hobbies about the weather about the food about anything like random that people can understand and they can reply very easy yeah. but as a beginner if we are going to connect because connection is very important without speaking it is mm -hmm. not uh, you know uh, it is not going to help you So speaking yeah. is a part of the speaking. Speaking comes yeah. by speaking, walking comes by walking, writing comes by writing. This is true and okay. fact. So you have to speak, but try to think what should I speak. This yeah. is very important. As per the level, select the uh, topic, select the conversational questions. Thereafter, we can forward move. Yeah. So because yeah, first all. of all, you know, when we are learners, so first uh, uh, means in the uh, at least ten. Uh, ten conversation, you only face uh, fear and hesitation. Oh, After that, right. you will able to communicate with people. Absolutely all right. Even yeah. if I talk about myself, I am uh, from Hindi background. I am from uh, village background. I didn't have good courage at that situation. I was facing a lot problem. So mm -hmm. I did a lot of conversation audio calls. A lot. I was not able to speak a single word at that moment. I was. facing different problems not only the grammar but also the vocab so it was my i face a lot so this is that opinion what experience i got yeah just try to be continue be consistent more think about the others while the conversation if you during the conversation if you are going to think about others because most of time what happen in audio call if you are a beginner you are going to connect any upper level person maybe intermediate level yeah and the situation you are beginner if you think about little good english you feel oh my god he is a fluent person even he is not fluent he is learner he is doing hard work for it but maybe you are going to connect, uh, you are going to connect little good person that is reason your mind is going blank because of thought yeah. so we should try to keep our thoughts we should not think about others just yeah. we think they also learner i am also learner Yeah, if you are comfortable on video call, so I think this is a good platform. You are achieving your level. You are going to interact different people. So this is a very wonderful technique to enhance. Yeah, 
कम्युनिकेशन इज ओके सो आई थिंक आई व्हाट टाइम हैज डन ओ 21 मिनट इज डन सो आई थिंक वी कैन रैप अप आवर कन्वर्सेशन एंड वी कैन गो फॉर नेक्स्ट कन्वर्सेशन आल्सो बिकॉज वी हैव क्रॉस 20 एंड 21 मिनट मे बी इट वुड बी फाइन फॉर दिस टाइम so really uh, i enjoyed a lot with you you are a great speaker and i really i astonished a lot when i heard about you have been working only for one and a half month and the second one you started your communication just on video call so it's yeah. really amazing for me i really i'm so glad uh, that you have a great uh, confidence and, and we will do I you also enjoyed a lot and learn a lot of things from your side yeah sir thank you okay so we will meet next session and have a nice day bye bye same to you yeah